Well, again, on behalf of, of the fans, uh, this is for you, 20, 2024 team. I uh, wanted you to uh, just have some thoughts on um, what, I, what I think about you and what some of these uh, fans think about you guys. Uh, we appreciate you, and uh, you'll have to excuse me uh, a little bit of uh, indulgence there as I reference number 58, so uh, most of you know why I do that. But uh, anyway, uh, hope you enjoy it, and again, uh, get out there and uh, celebrate the Warriors. the 2024 season, Brookwood will be playing its last game. It hasn't gone the way anyone has wanted it to go. Many people play this game for what they can get out of it. Sometimes it's glory, fame, or titles. The game didn't allow for that this year. You've had to play for the love. Most people don't get it. They don't understand football. It was invented by Civil War soldiers, worried about the next generation wasn't gonna to be tough enough. I want to say that you are. You've given more to this game because you've had to. No glory, no adulation. Just put on those hot, smelly pads every day and work through the pain, through the sweat for the game itself. Me and many other Warrior fans will give you something you'll never be able to buy or bargain for, a man's respect. You have it. And I'm thankful for each of you players, coaches, and staff, especially the guy on the team I'm related to. Thank you, Brookwood Warriors and cheerleaders and staff and coaches for playing for something bigger than yourselves this year. Your play has made me better, you better, the fans better, and your school better. I thank you very much, and I couldn't be prouder.